Hi Pisces, what is up guys? I know I missed your reading and uh, that's why I'm starting the next week reading with you first. So Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus and Jupiter, let's see what is the first week of January bringing for you. This is going to be a love reading, right? And uh, we, we're going to see if you're having any specific person in your surroundings. What is this person thinking or feeling about you? What, are, what is your perspective towards them? The outcome and what advices you need to know, right? So Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus and Jupiter. Wait, wait, wait. Right, Pisces. Of course, reverse the rules if needed, switch the cases, but I never I would never suggest anybody to force a reading on the situation you're going through. If it's meant for you, you are just going to flow with the reading, right? So Pisces and love. Pisces and love. Oh, past life relationship. Very interesting. Pisces, what is coming towards you? First week of January. Okay. Messages for Pisces. Okay. Calling in your soulmate, your prayers, affirmations, and visualization help bring you together. So Pisces, if you have a specific person on your mind, I see a very strong law of attraction being worked here. I don't know if this person is trying to connect to you telepathically or physically by some means, or you have this on your mind, but I see a very important soul connection, a person you really deeply connect with is coming into... Uh, the play is coming is coming in your surroundings and for a lot of you if this is some relationship going on i see that there was some kind of gap till now i see something is happening this can be visualization and some kind of uh, law of attraction at, at work but i see you both coming into contact very soon right we also have playfulness interesting to recapture romance allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine so Pisces overall I see that there can be some situation where you're about to encounter love if you are till now at a distance with somebody if there was communication gap I see two people rekindling and uh, if this is something uh, you are already experiencing I see someone might call you to go on a date someone might reach out to you we also have it's safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. So Pisces, overall, they are very positive and uh, subtle messages for a lot of you. Oh my God, this wedding. Okay, this can eventually lead to something, but I would just refrain from saying anything on this energy for time being because I see something is very naive right now. Someone wants to reconnect with you. You might hear from this person very soon and uh, this person is definitely thinking about you and i think you are also feeling and thinking something about this person it's very safe for you to open up right now i do see compassionate proposal of love coming your way so interesting pisces for a lot of you i'm picking up that you might go on a date with somebody someone is asking you out for a date i see very light and jolly energy here right okay so we have calling in your soulmate playfulness and it's safe for you to love right Pisces diving into your reading let us see what is happening here the situation definitely involves marriage so maybe right now one of you is in a committed relationship or you both see each other as you know the important counterparts divine counterparts or somebody you are thinking that you have a future with this person but overall I'm picking up a kind of energy where it's very safe for you to open up in this connection right it's safe for you to trust on someone and you're getting the same vibe from this person oh yeah ace of wands i see for a lot of you i see new passion coming in right this may lead to something long term fresh and promising but right now it's starting with a very naive conversation again for a lot of you i see if you're single guys get ready for some important uh, for some exciting dating scene right i see someone coming in as coming in and asking you out if you were on a kind of break with someone i see an important partner there so this person can come in and ask you out for some rekindle energy and if you are already in a relationship i see something igniting right something fresh some romance very positive energy for love for you it's six of pentacles for them it's king of cups oh my god so you might be dealing with a cancer pisces scorpio but this person has a big cup of love for you again the same message that if you are interested 
I see you, if you are interested, of course, I see this person is bringing in a proposal and they might show a very small sign that uh, let's talk, let's exchange numbers, let's go for a walk or let's go for a coffee. But I see they have much more than they are showing to you, much more than what they're showing to you. You, on the other hand, appear quite balanced right now, Pisces. I see you are in that phase where you are maintaining a good, happy balance in your life. Your perspective here is that I want to uh, stay in a very safe environment. You might be working, you might be, uh, you know, balancing your finances, investing money, taking care of your responsibilities. I see a very balanced approach to life right now. Good work life and personal life balance for a lot of you I'm picking up here. Overall, Six of Pentacles is a very giving energy. And in this card, I feel that this is the energy where you want to invest into different places and uh, carry on your responsibilities and take care of everyone along with you. So very light and balanced energies for you. But this person is coming in with a lot of emotions and they have a message for you. They have an important message for you here. In your personal space, yeah, I see that you know some things are getting delayed here. Pisces, on your mind that shows me devil with the seven of pentacles. For some of you, I see you are willing to wait. I get a kind of message that you're interested in talking to this person right now. But if this is not a marriage scenario, you might feel like um, giving it some time. If this is marriage scenario, if someone is asking you out for marriage or long-term commitment, you want to take it slow. Devil shows me with the Seven of Pentacles. There is some thought on your mind which is telling you to go slow, invest a little, let the other person come and show their investment. For some of you, this is the energy where I have done my work. Now let the other person do something. Devil energy actually shows me that uh, you're, you're thinking a little self-centered here, right? So maybe right now you're waiting for a third person for some of you, I also heard that this person appears quite promising. It's a new date. Maybe you have, um, you're going out somewhere and this person might find you there and reach out to you there. But back of your mind, you're waiting for a specific person. So anything like that can happen. Devil can show me some kind of uh, little obsessive thinking also. But on your part, I see that you want to wait. Instead of jumping the gun, you want to wait because I see you doing quite well in your personal scenario, right? Talking about the specific person, Pisces, I see, oh my God, six, oh my God. This person sees very strong bond with you, right? Lovers with the Six of Cups shows me that I think they're coming in a point where, coming to a point where they want to make a decision towards you, Pisces. Six of Cups, if there was gap between you both, for some of you, this is an acquaintance. For some of you, uh, this can be a person you have already dated in past or you have met this person before. It is not a completely new person. You have known this person before, but maybe you were not looking at this person from that perspective till now, but they have always, they always had a corner for you. They always had feelings for you. And now finally they're coming in to tell you that. They might say in a very subtle manner, they might tell you that, okay, Pisces, if you're not seeing anybody, we can go for a coffee like that. But they are not showing you that they have a lot more than what they're telling you, right? So lovers shows me that they are making some decision based on their past experiences. Six of Cups to the lovers is the energy where this person has been through a lot of things lately, especially when it comes to love. And now they're understanding that this is the divine timing. This is some kind of decision. Lovers shows me that they are making a decision here. And that decision is definitely taking them towards you, right? But devil on your part shows me that probably you're not that sure of the situation as compared to this person. Like they are totally sure that this is divinely guided and uh, wow, they have that strong connect with you and they are making a decision for that, right? Okay, Six of Cups definitely shows me that they have some memories and they remember the history you both have shared. So they are coming up and making this decision for a lot of you, right? So let's see where is the situation heading, Pisces. Overall, it's quite interesting. Okay, Magician, the Fool, the Three of Cups and the Justice. Okay, 
Well, I still see that you both are not on the same page when it comes to this connection. They are coming in to manifest it. Magician with the Ace of Wands, I see they have a very clear mindset of what they want with you. And I see someone coming up front, even if they are not telling you exactly what they are feeling, what their feelings are. But they're definitely coming up with an effort, right? Strong effort, a plan to manifest it. On your part, Pisces, I see, I think you're not very sure of commitment. Though you're very, you might be very excited to meet this person. If it's a date, you might feel that, okay, fool with three of cups. You might feel that uh, what's wrong in actually going out and sitting with this person, giving, giving it a try, I'm sorry. Fool shows me that you're ready for something very fresh in your life. You have released all the past baggages till now that you were carrying. And for a lot of you, I'm getting this message that whatever this is, this can be any kind of situation that you have been facing in your personal life also if this is work this is family or anything i see you getting ready to take a leap of faith in your life for you it's very positive very very positive with maybe some fears some doubts devil can also be some negative energy on your mind from your past you know past subconscious you know something coming back from your subconscious mind which is telling you to hold back and wait Again, the message is it's safe for you for you to love if you are single and if you're looking for dating. I think this this is a good match, right? Justice shows me again the balance energy. You don't want anything to distort your personal life's balance because you are in that comfort zone right now, Pisces. I see six of pentacles, quite giving, quite nurturing, caring, light, light energies for you. But there are some subconscious fears for sure. Devil shows me strong addiction to something, strong attachment to something which is little and healthy at this point of time. Justice is the energy where you are understanding that I need to balance the situation, right? I know how much I have to give in this situation and I know how much I have to take in a situation. So if at some point you might feel that this person is doing too much, right? Maybe you're just open for dating and they're coming with a very strong proposal of long-term commitment or wedding or something like that. I see you're going to set the record right with this person and you're going to tell them what exactly you're looking for right now. Because it's definitely not long-term right now on your mind. Fool shows me that you're ready for a new beginning, but for how long it's going to last, you have nothing like that on your mind, right? So justice and three of cups for them, they are just so happy. They're just so happy. Even if this person gets a chance to sit and talk about uh, something on that front with you, I think they're going to be very, very happy. <coughs> it's kind of reconciliation for them. And for a lot of you, I see they might bring in presents, flowers, something like that to impress you. But I see you have this very clear on your mind that I need to set the record right. I need to balance the situation by telling this person exactly what I'm looking for because I am probably in a very good state right now very good environment right now I don't know if I'm totally ready to you know start something like that right now okay that's quite interesting uh, last but not the least okay so before I wind up the reading, I just want to know what is this justice? Because I see that you're quite clear. You're quite clear on your mind what you truly want here. And um, for a lot of you, I'm getting this message that you're happy to see this person. It's overall a very happy and positive energy. The only difference might be that uh, you both have different expectations right now. You both have different expectations right now. For example, if they are looking for something more stable you are looking for something that is right now fulfilling you want to live in the present moment because you are somehow balancing a lot of things together right what is this justice for pisces justice energy striking the balance making a decision telling the other person what you want what you think of Okay, we have three of swords, two of swords, and the... Uh, oh, are you breaking someone's heart, Pisces? King of Cups is here twice. Magician is here on your part again. I see that uh, you have some plans. You have an outlook. And for a lot of you, I get this message that you know what, where you want to head, right? For some of you, it can be totally passion. Playfulness is on your part. I see you love the chemistry you share with this person and um, devil shows me that there are some some subconscious fears or some past memories that 
till now you have not released for a lot of you this can be the one with you have with whom you have dealt in past and you have had, you have had some kind of history together six of cups this person understands that and they miss it and they want to come back but you might be having different plans here right magician is the kind of energy which shows me that you are in that manifestation mode so working alone loving yourself again one number singularity is there so this shows me that maybe right now you're not in that space where you have too much space in your life to accommodate anybody or simply you are just loving your loving your energy three of swords shows me that justice with the three of swords shows me that you might be a little upfront here because the blockage probably is on your part right they're very clear what they want and they want is you what they want is you two of swords i see that you are not very decisive here right now Pisces. so this week can be the time period where you might convey this message to somebody that i'm not very decisive about the future of this connection or the future of whatever chemistry we are sharing let's give it some time i see this person is going to be very emotional king of cups again for some of you you might be dealing with two water signs but I, I feel personally that this is the same person who is feeling little uh, emotional. Your decision can be very difficult between letting the connection go or looking at the emotions this person is bringing on the table. It might be very difficult for you to choose. But eventually I do see that you're understanding that uh, I will have to make a very practical decision. Magician is very practical energy of manifestation. So interesting. Let us see, Pisces, what do you need to know as we enter in? Prosperity lies ahead. As we enter this week, Pisces, what do you need to know? Messages for Pisces, please. Adjustments are required. So maybe right now you are in that mode where your personal space, your personal life is taking too much of your time and too much of your energy. At this point in time, you might not be very welcoming to this connection or at least the way they are looking towards it, right? I see different perspective here. Your dreams need a practical plan. Very interesting. We also have bring love to the situation, Pisces. Try not to be too upfront. I see this person is very compassionate for you. Even if you're not looking for this uh, at the same way as this person is doing, try to sit on the table and talk to them. Because I see that they're bringing a lot of compassion on the table, a lot of compassion on the table, right? Your hard work is paying off. For some of you, I see you are deeply involved in a work situation and you're loving your work life, personal life, love life and all kind of balance that you're sharing right now. The kind of ease with which you're managing everything, you don't want it to get distorted. Your hard work is paying off. I see work life is going to be quite promising. You might get some promotion or some raise, which is very positive. So time for healing. So maybe right now you need a break from this thing and it is going to be hard on this person. So be a little compassionate, right? <laughs> That's what I heard. So these are the messages I have for you, Pisces. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Bye-bye.